Hello guys, welcome back to another video by yours truly, Kimochis, and it's been about a week or so about an, on updates, and I'm glad to say I am finally, as you can see up here in my mouse, about to hit the level cap of level 70, which is the current cap for this patch, and I'll be doing that momentarily because, uh, get this quick. Three gems. But yeah, I'm gonna get level 70. Well, I'm trying to rush level 70 because in about three days, there will be an update that will give people who hit level cap. Yes. That will give everyone a level cap and armor extraction ticket for us. So I'm assuming that season 2 armor will be coming out and season 2 gear is really spectacular. I'll show you guys momentarily a little so something special that I've acquired. Like, Three, four hours ago. So stay tuned to that. But first, let's get the full set. I'm gonna cheat, and by cheating, I'm gonna use my instant tickets because it saves me time, and I don't have to grind through the dungeons. So let's use these real quick. And really quite simple for those that don't watch my uh, game uh, videos at all. These clear the dungeon for you, so you don't have to do anything at all. All you have to do is, if you have the tickets, hit five times to clear five, clear five times. Boom, easy. So this one right here should give me the level up. No, I don't have inventory, are you serious? Alright, I thought I cleared something out, but I guess not. Well, alright, I guess it's time for me to spoil then, since I'm already here. Um, alright guys, so, like four hours ago, <coughs> I fused the best weapon for my scythe user, any key. And it's the Berserker Gaia's Dominance. Now, what makes our Dominion? Do domination. Why do I say Dominion? So, what makes this weapon the best is because. Uh, let me move my camera real quick. It's that. One, it's a Berserker. And Berserker is arguably the best skill, as you can see right here. What this skill does is. Whenever your HP gets to gets to a certain threshold, you you take a reduced damage by a large amount. So right now my Berserker is level 10, and if I get to Immortal tier, which is next tier after Legendary, it will be at level 15, I think, and that will be an extraordinary amount of damage reduction at 10% HP or less. And this basically gives me a lot of uh, damage resistance when I it basically prevents me from getting one shot by like a lot of people, and that's really good for PvP. And since I'm not PvP focused, but I assume that if I'm going to do PvP and energy is not that great, and that's my uh, Hero Smite right here, and it's not like super greatest, but it's energy and I would use it for now. So yeah, Berserker is arguably the best skill, and I guess energy would be like third or something. Um, what else makes this good is that it's a Season 2 weapon, and Season 2 weapons are these three uh, new tiers of weapons. I have another one right here, I'm going to show it to you guys. I made this one like a couple days ago and it's another season 2 weapon but this one the crit I think the crit rate was pretty low a base crit rate was pretty low and it's giant I don't really want giant I want berserker because I want aiming for so I got the I think the best crit rate and crit damage season 2 weapon with a berserker stat on it and that's really really good also it has the enhanced skill for one of the best PvP skills for an Annika, which is basically if I hit someone and they get knocked up, I can basically add an additional combo to it if they get knocked into the air, which is really nice. Some more damage for me. So I'm um, this is my weapon right here that I've made earlier today and I'm really happy and I hopefully I'm gonna do whatever it takes to get to max as possible because the staff gain on this weapon is insane. Now let's upgrade this weapon a bit since I have a lot of fodders I want to get rid of. And I want to make this video longer than I have to. Let me get my webcam back on. Okay. Uh, so it's only level 6 right now. It's going to be a long time before I get this thing to max. Ew, get this thing out of the way. I don't know why it's going to be. Okay. So 14 levels to uh, Immortal, and then I have to get another 20 levels. That's, that's gonna take a long time. Alright, one more ticket to go, and we are done with our mission of getting level 70. Nice, nice, nice. Boom, there it is, level 70. Ooh, I rolled over this. Level 
70. Nice, nice, nice. More skill points, more adventure points, a little bit more attack, and a little bit more defense. Nice, I'll take it. Ooh, achievement. Let's open that real quick. Yeah, that's a free and more weapon for me. Level 70, a new weapon, and what else do I have to give up? I'm saving my gems for the next costume update, so you can look forward to that. Um, I also did one costume roll, because I was getting pretty bored, honestly, because waiting for it for us forever. Oh, did I mention I got a cloak? Yeah, I got a cloak from those uh, event boxes that they're giving them out, and I got that one, I think, at the bottom. It's an epic. Not that I'll replace it eventually, but it's something to hold on to for now. And I rolled this my uh, 5,000 gems, which gives me crit damage and damage increase, so it's really nice. And yeah, that's about it for update, guys. Um, there should be an update coming around this week, and it's ho hopefully it's a costume one, because I want to use my gems already. And I'm going to roll on those, and I don't know, let's see what we have to do. What I have to do right now is I need to get my weapon, that weapon I showed you guys earlier, to max. And basically, I got a bank on season two uh, equipment for gear because the stat bonus for the season two gear, the one I want, gives crit rate and crit damage, whereas this one just gives damage reduction and crit rate, which is terrible. But since season two gear is usually better in defense, I'm not missing out on too much defense reduction. I'm getting seven percent more crit rate and I'm getting more crit damage as well, which is really nice, and I really want this set. So I guess I'll, I'm saving on those, which is right here. I'm saving up uh, gear or fodder or whatever to use as synthesis materials to get a hopefully season 2 legendary gear piece. Alright, that's it for this video guys. I want to keep it short and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.